TFNN. Headline News Update. Hey, good afternoon, everyone. Larry Pesavento giving you a mid-afternoon update of stock market. Well, we've got Christmas Day here, folks. we got red. We've got green. We've got the notes and bonds are up a little bit, and we've got the stock indices are down, uh, not a little bit, uh, Dow's down 70, S&P's down about 38, very critical levels that we're sitting at right now. And we've got the currencies a missed bag with the uh, euro is down a little bit, pound is up a little bit. Uh, that's pretty much uh, all that's going on. The grain markets are doing uh, very, very little. So it's we're at a real critical day, folks, as far as where we stand with the stock market setting here in the Dow Jones, and especially in the S&P at this level of a 40-45. If you'll remember, we have been talking about that for just about two weeks now, that uh, that is a very important 382 retracement. And even though the market is selling off, it has a very, very bullish undertone from looking at it on a technical basis. I'll bring up a chart here that you folks uh, may or may not be interested in, but uh, it looks like it has a possibility here of making some type of a, a very significant bottom in here uh, from looking at it on a technical basis. Now, this will all change. And remember, we have President's Day this coming week, so the markets will be trading Sunday night on Globex. They start around uh, four o'clock, uh, six o'clock in the evening, New York time, and they'll trade through till about eleven in the morning on uh, Monday. They'll go till about noon on Monday, so they're going to trade all Sunday night and all Monday, and then things uh, open up again uh, late Monday night at uh, six o'clock again. Everything goes back to Globex again, and then we start our regular routine on Sunday. Remember, the rest of the world does not recognize our President's Day. In fact. Uh, our president's day here in uh, the uh, the state of Arizona was uh, no no it was Martin Luther King Day. <laughs> Mr. Reagan didn't think that uh, Mr. Uh, the Dr. King deserved a, a, a no it wasn't Reagan it was the governor of Arizona he did he didn't want to I forget what the guy's name was. Any anyway, I I remember that it was wasn't Reagan at all it was the governor of Arizona and. Uh, he uh, he said no we don't we're not going to have a president's day for him they didn't have any martin luther king boulevards here until uh, oh my gosh the late 80s so it was after reagan became president that that became a big deal anyway that's a little historical fact that you didn't need to know anything about and i'm not even sure of it 877-927-6648 stay for fibonacci 24/7 we'll be right back 